Hey, hey, everybody, this is Larry. This is. Um, yeah, day 13 of the Lico Daddy Challenge. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, join me on Discord. Let me know what you think about today's farm and today's, um, you know, everything. Uh, yeah, so I'm still here. Or I just got here in Almaty um, in Kazakhstan. Uh, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, all that stuff. But uh, my drone video is from a couple of days ago in Uzbekistan in a, in a very pretty mountain reservoir area. Um, went up the trail and it was very fun, very, very fine. Uh, so yeah, um, let's take a look at today's farm, shall we? Sorry, I'm a little bit uh, ugh, out of it. But all right, 2352, equal rows and column pairs. So given the silver next end to end, we turn the number of pairs such that all sub iron columns of CR equal. A row and a column pair is equal if they contain the same elements in the same order. Okay. So basically, for example, uh, what is this? 277 is equal. Okay, fine. Uh, and it's equal to 200. But So what that means is that um, maybe you could do n cubed, right? Basically, for every n, you know, you, you do a comparison and that should be okay. Another thing that you can do is, uh, so that would be n cubed. Maybe that's okay. Maybe that's not, depending on because uh, uh, 8 million is one of those like borderline numbers and, and maybe it's fine it depends on how many test cases there are <coughs> <coughs> oh excuse me sorry we're going this live so oh man hope everyone's okay um, another thing that you can do of course uh, so that's going to be like I said 8 million ish but another thing they could do is just hash, hash each row and hash each column. And once you do that, you know you could do it in, um, you know, you, you could do it in n squared time. Uh, is it n squared time? No, it's just uh, n time, right? Uh, well, maybe n squared. It is n squared time in that for for each row you do o of n, and o of n operation, and you do two of them: one to hash and one for lookup. And uh, yeah, and that should be good. So let's let's get to it. And let's go to length of grid. And then let's just hash the rows, for example. So rows is equal to set. You can do a, a number of ways of hashing it, but the way that I'm going to do it, you'll see in a second. Oops. Is just um. So current is equal to let's just say. Uh, Um, or maybe it's equal to do 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 dot join um, string um, yeah, y u for v in grid of x, right? <clears throat> so that and then hash or uh, rows dot curve, right? So that's just basically the it, it's a very simple thing. It's just a space uh, delimited space delimited values of order of things, and then we just add it to number of rows, right? And then uh, and count is equal to zero, we return count and and for y is in range of n, then this one's a little bit more annoying to write, but still should be okay, right? So you know maybe uh cause is equal to do 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 the xy, right? And then at the end again we just write the same thing, right? Uh, except for this is in cars now, and then after that we just do a lookup, right? If current is in rows, then count increment by one. That's pretty much it. Like I said, this is going to be n square time. <coughs> oh, <man. coughs> um, maybe not. Uh, okay. <coughs> Whew, sorry, friends. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, I see. Uh, yeah, so I don't know why I did it this way, to be honest. Now that I think about it, right? So, da, 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 da. Uh, the non unique is the reason, but wow, that, that is a sloppy mistake, to be honest. I wasn't, I really wasn't thinking about it. If it wasn't an example, I would have gotten it wrong, to be frank. Uh, but yeah. Now it should be good. And let's give it a submit. 
And the coughing is really driving me a little bit off today. And I guess this was a contest about a year ago. And like I said, this is going to be N square. This one maybe is harder to see, but this one should be more obvious. And the hash should be also linear as well, but it doesn't get dominated or anything. So it's just N square in total. Um, and N square is going to be fast enough getting that N is only 200. And also N square here does not mean quadratic time, right? N square here actually means linear time because n squared is the size of the input so definitely keep that in mind um yeah that's all i have with this one let me know what you think stay good stay healthy to good mental health i'll see y'all later and take care bye bye